Hey, what's happening, people? Uh, so we made it short. Welcome back to Final Fantasy. How's everybody doing? Hopefully you guys are having a good one. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. We'll be starting momentarily. Although, you know who is back. Doesn't matter, you already started. <clears throat> Alright, so uh, hopefully you guys are having a good one, and uh, you're ready for Final Fantasy. We're going to find out today if um, the uh, Gold Saucer thing is going to happen with Red or Tifa. Hooray! I have instruments to measure stuff, uh, Leroy. They're here. <clears throat> What's this chapter called again? chapter they refer to as whoops the golden key a golden key our buggy. So the team is completely separated now. So we should make another save file just in case. Actually, I, I believe we made a save file before even coming here. Um, I hope so. This is a golden key, a golden key. So that says 67 minutes and 46. This is a gold saucer. This one is a training gym. So I saved before or after the training gym sequence, so just remind me of that, if you would. This one says training gym. So, okay. Let's see what happens, I suppose. I have a bad feeling about this. Okay, so everything is open up now. Where was the big dance thing held at the beginning? Was it here? Dun, 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 dun. I don't know if Amber's gonna be here or not. She might. There's the gator. So basically the gold saucer is like this giant uh, theme park. And we are in chapter 12. Once we complete this, this will be the end of chapter 12. Lady and her kid. Alright, so how do we get... Oh, we just go through the center. Yeah, welcome to paradise, exactly. Cornero versus Dio? Okay. Attention to detail is crazy. Mm -hmm. Hi, sweetheart. Listen up. This vacation 
mission is on a tight schedule. We've you lost your glasses. I you, you took them off to give me a hug. And then I don't know what happened. Gone. Then they're gone. As soon as you take them off, they're gone. That's why I really like the context better because once I lost I know, I know. Once I lost the context, I could just put another one in my eye, and then no one had to know how often I lost them. Which I, I lost my context just as often, but no one could tell. You couldn't lose your context because they were inside your eyes. Oh, I could lose them. Ah. The attention to detail is crazy. I don't want to know. Well, I used to wear contacts while I was playing soccer, and if I got hit, like, the ball hit me, and I would, like, jostle around a lot, even if it didn't hit my face. Mm. If it hit me, like, in the stomach or in my... anywhere, like, in my side or something, and I, like, my head swung forward really fast, my contacts would fall out of my eyes. So, how you want to kick this off? Dio's located... We're trying to find Dio right also, now. Also, if I'm up for a long time, and I would have my contacts, and I would rub my eyes... Ooh. My contacts could fall out of my eyes. Ah! Yep. Ow. It wouldn't hurt. Sounds like it would hurt. Where would you like to go, Kubo? Not the contacts. You're thinking of contacts from, like, really olden days or something. Like, modern contacts. Okay, they, make them, like, they don't... They used to have hard contacts. They don't make hard contacts really anymore. We've arrived at your destination! Contacts used to be hard. Now contacts are very soft. They're like... Alright, we're in Battle Square. The consistency of a contact. Wait, why are we talking to Aerith? Check it out, Cloud. Can you believe this? Corneo? The Dawn outstayed his welcome in Midgard and decided to set up shop in the saucer. Great timing, eh? Interesting. There's an event being held at the Musclehead Coliseum tomorrow. If there's a dress rehearsal today, Dio might be there. We should check it out. Corner wait, where's Tifa? Oh, shoot. Yeah, when I used to play soccer, I used to have my contacts fall out all the time on the soccer field. And it wouldn't be until... Aha! Found him! Greetings, Mr. Director! Hmm. He doesn't look quite right. Hmm. Well, if it isn't our friendly fugitives, you're looking hale and hearty. What happened to you? I made a painful discovery. That the Turks are stronger than they look. You, sir, should know better. You're no spring chicken. Speaking of old things, whatever happened to that wee keystone thingy? We need to get our hands on it. Hmm. It was part of your collection, last we heard. Hmm. It was, yes. And in fact, still is. Point of order. My ancestors owned it. Don't you think that makes me its rightful owner? Hmm. A cetera, are you? That, my dear, is a bold claim. <laughs> but still, who am I to dispute your heritage? You may, of course, have the keystone. That is, on one condition. You must take part in our exclusive event, the fight for naming rights. Dio's champions versus the Corneo family. Should my team fall to those rogues, the gold saucer will become Corneo land. Flex it out. Training hard and getting those gains. What's up, party people? What's up? 
Hey. It's a challenge from the dark. Signed Come and on. notified. Give the people what they want. Take it. Entertain. But look at me. I can barely lift a finger. And here I was lamenting my lot in life when you came along. Tis fate. Nay, divine intervention. What say you? Will you be my champions and go to war against Don Corneo? I'll do it. I'll fight. We win, we get the keystone. Right? As agreed, you have my word. Then we're in. Then we have ourselves a deal. <laughs> Naturally, I want you in peak physical condition for the big bout, so please use my hotel to rest up. Great. I'll jog on ahead and tell the others there. All right, so this is the moment of truth. Do we get Tifa, or do we get the dog? <laughs> The fate of the gold saucer rests on your shoulders. Don't let me down. I'm gonna rant if we get the dog, just so you know. I'll be very, very upset. <sighs> okay. Listen up, combat hungry All these Shinra people should be gone. Okay, there's nothing here anymore. This is where all those people got yeeted. Not enough? Wanna step inside the ring? I have no idea where Tifa is. <laughs> okay, Lee, we invited you to the Kings Discord. It's all taken care of. Thanks for helping me with the process, and thank you, Leroy. Oh, thank you so much, PJ. Thank you, Leroy, for helping with that. Thank you. Thank you for that. Uh, thank you so much for the super chat, um, PJ. And thank you for the help, Leroy. Event Square. Where in the world is Tifa hanging out? And away we go! Oh, thank you, Leroy, for the super chat. It says there is a Tifa side quest on Chocobo Race. She's at the Chocobo Race right now? Oh, thank you, PJ. That's very kind of you. Did I already miss it, Leroy? Or is that later? We've arrived at your destination. Tifa. Attention, Chocobo race fans. That's not Tifa. Oh, hey, Cloud, got some news. Apparently, the powers that be like what we have to offer. Gave us permission to race in the Gold Cup. So I went and signed you up as soon as I could. After all, you're the best jockey I know. The cup is three races, and you get points based on where you place in each. Bird with the most at the end wins. But the races are nothing like you've ever seen before. You gotta be on the ball if you want to take the top spot. Anyway, when you're ready to face off against the finest riders this side of the continent, head on over to registration. Your bird will be in peak condition. Trust me. Win the gold cup? I can try. Welcome, sir. We've been waiting for you. How long is the Gold Cup? The Gold Cup is now available to gold rank jockeys. Oh, I don't think I'm a gold rank jockey. Am I? New difficulty level unlocked. Chocobo race! Is this gold? I mean, I can try it. 
Select a grade. Uh, maiden. Chocobo Classic. Where's gold? Bomb blowout. Memorial or the ultimate stakes. Gold saucer point. I don't even see the gold cup. Is this a gold cup? I I don't know. What's the new race? Uh Huh. I I don't even know what Whoa. Why is that why you come on my phone? You need to complete race to unlock the gold. Which which race do I need to unlock, uh, Leroy? Cactus Classic, Moogle, Oaks, Derby. Does it matter which one? I like my blue bird. You have to do ten races. Wow. Any of them. Any of them, alright. Alright, here we go. Sorry. Is that my is that my blue bird? Look like my blue bird. Oh my wait. Serene. So she is fast, sort of. Good balance. Yellow chocobos aren't very fast at all. The green one is pretty fast. Yeah, thank you for the kind words, PJ, and thank you for being so kind and hanging on for that. I'm sorry I wasn't able. And thanks again, Leroy, for taking care of that. Thank you guys for the super chats. Very sweet. Thank you very much. All right, here we go. Racing time. It's racing time. I've got the need. The need for speed. Let's go, Cloud. Apparently, you have to win 10 races, guy. Whoops. That did not go the way I wanted it to. Question is are you guys faster than the mage? Ouch. Actually, I'm not doing very well at all. I'm a blue chocobo. That is, yes, I'm a blue chocobo. Racing red ones and other colored chocobo. It's only the first lap though. Maybe I can somehow pull this off. I'm not the greatest at Mario Kart though, so. The other guy's way ahead. No, I'm not. It's a tight battle for second place. I need to get first. And the other dude is way up there. Lapis is. Well, it's going to be a little closer now. Maybe. I'd right, start in the third lap. Oh shoot. Don't go on the grass, me. I have a watery death for you if you try to pass me. I don't even know what those do. Oof.
Zelda's watching where? Oh, Zelda's so while she likes the bird. Alright, so that's one race down. Okay. Let's go again. Cloud Tifa would be their ship name. Uh. Okay. Maiden race. Moogle Oaks. Go Cloud, go! Go Blue Chocobo! Think Sonic! You got the need, the need for speed. Oops. Those sound real weird. Didn't they start to name, like, have... Wasn't that like a 2000s thing where you started to add celebrities' names together to create a couple in or something? Yeah, that... that uh, Benifer is the first time I remember hearing it with uh, Ben and Jen. And then after that it became like a thing. So far, so good. Whoa! Our name mashed together probably sounds weird. <laughs> Lamber or oop? It's weird. It's really weird. Wow, where are these other guys? Oh, they are behind me. Like blood clot, that's that's a that's a great couple name. Hello, this is blood clot. Now introducing the couple blood clot. I'm flying. Oh no, I made a terrible mistake. Luke Ember. That's how it would work. Uh, I mean, our names sound cooler as Luke and Amber. But... Mm -hmm. So I had a hard time answering a poll today. Like, somebody was saying, Can you name your favorite Ninja Turtle? I said, nope. Can't do it. Because I like different turtles from other media, so I cannot have a definitive Ninja Turtle because I don't don't know what their personality is, because their personality changes every series. Leo was my favorite movie turtle. The first, like, the first 90s movie. Um, my video game turtle of choice is always Donatello. My favorite cartoon turtle was Raphael, because he broke the fourth wall. My favorite turtle in the, uh, 2003 series was Raphael, because he acted like the movie Raph, but he was cooler. Um... And then there was another, um, the 2012 series, I believe I was a Mikey fan, I believe. Oh, right. we got a super chat. Hmm? 
Daffy, what games are we going to play in April and May? Um, Mario Thousand Year Door. Uh, we're, I think the Ninja Turtle game is happening in April still. Like, I don't know. Like, I'm... It might be an RPG. We, I mean, I'm pretty sure we'll be done with Final Fantasy soon. Can I not, can I not do this now? View tutorial. No, this is right, this is a bird. Derby. Ooh, this looks intense. Three, two, one. Chocobo! I like to race as a chocobo. Do, 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 do. I'm surprised they didn't give us a chocobo like. We had a chocobo racing game with Mario Kart, I thought. <laughs> Yeah, the cactuses are in every Final Fantasy game. I don't know, I was looking at games coming out in, ah, in May, or April and end of March on Switch, and there's really nothing interesting. I'm surprised that Nintendo doesn't have an April game this year. Whoa, what just happened? Ow, I'm in trouble. I'm in big trouble. I'm in big, 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 big trouble. No, 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 I don't have to do these races to do a date. I don't, I don't remember why I need to do these races. It's important, but it's not for a date with Tifa or date with whoever. I have to go back to the hotel and it's going to trigger the date. I'm scared. I don't want to go back to the hotel because I don't know what's going to happen. It, it. It's 50-50. It's going to be Tifa or it's going to be Red. It's not funny. Because I don't want to have a romantic... Uh... I don't want to take my dog on a... Um... No. Nope. 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 Stop it, Amber. Did we put in the timeout chair? Stop. dog. Don't be weird. Don't be weird. I read online that in order to romance one of the girls, you have to do all their side quests. I did all their side quests. I used all the synergy moves. I did not use all the synergy moves with Red. I only had two synergy moves for um, for Tifa, though. She's supposed to have three, so I don't know how to unlock her third synergy move. Oh, I know people will laugh at me if it's Red. Considering I tried so hard to get Tifa, it's pretty funny, I guess. Hilarious. <laughs> Alright, um, let's do another one, I guess. That was Cactar Derby. Next one is called... These races don't last very long. This one is called Bomb Blowout. No, oh, red is one of those that's just dating you to get the free meal thing. <laughs> yeah, he's, I forgot what that's called in the term now. I don't know. Oh my gosh, I can't remember this one. <laughs> <laughs> 
Bomb blowout. What does that mean? I'm going to throw bombs at people like this is Mario Kart. <laughs> Can you speedrun date and rebirth? No. Oh, when I get mad and I'd be like, I, I put 60 hours into this game and I ended up dating a stupid dog. It was an option in the original game. You could take any character on the sky wheel, even Vincent. Ouch! Holy crap, what was that about? I might not win this one. It was Palm Sunday today? Oops. I think I'm gonna win this one. I'm in big trouble. Do they let you restart races? Did the cat just growl at me? I asked, do they let you restart races? Yeah, they do. Bronze race. Blech. For a second there, I thought the chocobo was all beat up and damaged. Why are they called chocobos? There's Pete there. They're Pete. They're they're chocobos. It's just what they're called. Okay, I need to do a better job with this one. I have the need for chocobo speed. Oh, last time I exploded, that's what happened. So if you hit the bombs, that's why they call it the bomb area. That makes sense. There's obstacles. Oops! Yeah, the chocobos can move kind of quick. Oh my gosh, this, I might not be able to do the FIFA quest for Togo races. I'm not very good at this. I'm getting kind of decimated here. I'm in sixth place, I think. Fifth place. I mean, it's better than ninth place, but. Again, Daffy, for the super chat, and also PJ, and also Leroy. Thank you, guys. Appreciate that, guys. Really appreciate that. Thank you, guys, for all the help. Oops, I had one more lap. I don't know why I stopped there. I'm putting on <laughs> sex is red, red, red. You guys are mean. Well. well well, we'll be ready to laugh if it's red, but I will be sad because I really wanted to see Tifa Cloud. And it's over. One more try. Cloud can date the bird, says Kim Wing. You can't date the bird. I like how fast these are, says PJ. Yeah, They're definitely. very fast. 
He's gonna be a single dog dad forever, says D Guards. Maybe. Man's best friend is a dog for a reason. See, I told you I'm not very good at Mario when, Kart. When there are no when there when all the women have left you, you always have your dog. Dogs are always loyal. Dogs live quite a while. They live longer than cats, I think. Dog is a good friend to have because you can go out, you know, walk your dog and dogs like to play at the park. Cats, they just sit there and do nothing. Wow. I'm surprised that you're a cat person and not a dog person. Maybe I'm just very chill, that's why I'm a cat person. Cats like, don't do much. Because, like, a lot of people, especially guys, seem to prefer dogs because they like go out to the park and play frisbee and everything. Cool. You are chill. Even when you went out a lot, though, you liked cats or something. Mmm. Which is strange to me. Maybe I'm just a very calm person at home. I don't know. Yeah. Everyone has their preferences, though. As soon as I hit the wall, it's over. Hey Chase, I feel like you've been trying to get Tifa to be blue instead of Aerith, Barret. Mm. Tifa and Red are. No. Tifa and Red are both blue, so hopefully we get to choose who we take. You don't get to choose. Says DJ. You don't get to choose, unfortunately. I hope it's a Border Collie, the most active dog, dog in the world, says Jackson. <laughs> I didn't know that was the most active dog in the world. That's interesting, Jack. Well, I grew up with a uh, Labrador Retriever, and that's a pretty active dog. Mm. Whoa, somebody flew all the way there. There's a shortcut. I just saw it. Oh, wow. There's somebody who flew all the way there. Yeah, I'm... By the way I'm saying it, making him a single dad dog, it makes it less weird, so something mm -hmm. Here I am, like, singing Kenny G over here in the background, looks like, stop. <laughs> there is a shortcut to winning this one. There is a way to fly. I don't know how they did it, but there is a trick to beating this one. There Probably for people who aren't very good at racing, like me. Like this type of racing. I'm not good at chocobo racing. There is one more Tifa side quest, but it is one versus two with hard enemies, says Leroy. Bring it on. Mm -hmm. How in the world did the bird fly? There's something over here. Oh my gosh, I found the secret. Oh my gosh! This is it! Hmm. I got it! Good job! I cheated, but I'll take it! <laughs> I did, I found a shortcut. Square included a shortcut. I guess I'm imagining, like, Cloud being like, You look lovely this evening. <laughs> and Red, all scraggly there with all his scars and everything. <laughs> like, um, One, thank two, you. three, four, five. We're gonna do five races for now, and then we'll try five races later. Oh my gosh. Not cheating if it's included as part of the race, the sense of gaming. Yeah, I, well, whatever. What does that say? Malbro? I don't even know what that says. It says Mal... Malboro. Ma Malboro. Malboro, yeah. It was like Kirby hype. Um, so guys, we have a YouTube short to push tonight. It's a Lego short. So. <laughs> Red just wants Cloud to buy a mistake. True, Jackson. There's no problem buying a mistake. I'm. That's fine. No problem buying a mistake. I don't care. Yeah. Red wants payback for all those times that chicken abused him. 
Mmm. Brett got kicked in the face by that chicken. All right, guys and gals, keep your eyes out for uh, a shortcut. That's how you win is a shortcut. <laughs> what? Captain Dex says, says, I'm sorry, but I am on the side of red. <laughs> <laughs> Captain Zack is rooting for Red. That's awesome, Captain Zack. Mm. Oh my gosh. Oh, the music sounds cool. Yeah, definitely. I'm here. We're all here for you, Luke, to support you. No matter what happens. Yeah. I'm here for moral support. I'm here for when you start crying because Red is there. That was kind of fun. Ha, 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 ha. Someone should make an AMV video. Well, that I am picturing that song, "Darling, You Look Beautiful." Tonight. It's a dog, Amber. Please stop. <laughs> They're literally weird people that okay, fantasize about being married to their that. pets. I know that. I know that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's disturbing, yeah, and yeah. it's actually illegal. It is illegal. Good. I know that. I'm just like really being with children and pets is illegal, and it's always been illegal. I know. And it needs to be a harsh crime too. I know that. Mm. It's called animal abuse. And child abuse. I know that. So there is a thing for me to do that involves... Wait, I'm winning? No, wait. Oh, am I winning? I'm not very good at the drifting, so I'm just kind of, like, not drifting. No, it's all just like, thank you. Somebody needed to say it. Haha! -ha! I'm a jerk! Don't care! Let's go! Oh. Wow, interesting. Wow, 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 wow. Oh, we have animal and child abusers that are hacking us now. Yep. Seems to be the case, doesn't it? Sickos. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh, yeah. Makes Point. sense. Makes sense! You're in line with those things. Wow. Well, guys, we said that it's important to protect animals and children from, um from being uh, assaulted and abused and then right when we said that we got hacked ah. so that should tell you the kind of people that are literally hacking our videos people that should be in federal prison yep 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 very interesting Come on, birdie, go, go, go! So the shortcuts are the key. The shortcuts is what you want to do. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. We've confirmed that the hackers are child abusers. Makes sense. Well, now that I know, if they don't go to if they don't go to prison for hacking us, they'll probably go to prison. After being oh, caught, don't don't you know, Amber? On once once they get arrested to further prove that they were DDoSing, their computers get seized, their hard drives get seized, everything they own will be checked. Yeah. So I mean, a uh, felony for DDoSing is only twenty years, but child abuse is much much longer felony. Ooh. So you guys hacking us think it's okay to assault children? Yeah, that's funny. Pretty messed up. Pretty messed up. We eagerly await your return. We eagerly await our return, okay. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I think they forgot that part. Like, uh, when you get raided by the police, they're gonna take your hard drives. So, uh. Good. Then we can oh, stop a hello, lot of abusers We're all looking forward to seeing you in people. action again. One less child abuser on the streets. There you go. Yeah, I don't think prison is kind to those kind of people either. Nope. So, 
Good luck making it through your second week in prison. What about an- yep, exactly, Sons of Gaming. I don't know. I don't really know. I don't know the amount of years you get for each of those crimes, but it should be a lot of years. It's disgusting. So, you would get two sentences. If you have CP on your computer, that's a 20-year prison sentence. DDoSing is a computer fraud felony in the state of Pennsylvania with a maximum prison sentence of 15 to 20 years. So you would get two 20-year sentences. Awesome! That's 40 years in jail! Mm. Well, they say everything happens for a reason, so... I guess you're DDoSing us so that you can be put in jail so you don't hurt anybody. I knew woke people were insane. My gosh, you guys are really team child abuser? Holy crap, that is just, wow, take the L. DDoSing freaks. I cannot believe that we mentioned it, that it, makes sense. it is wrong to abuse children and animals and right then people started DDoSing us. Mm -hmm. Like, what the actual, what is wrong with you, mm -hmm. freaks? <laughs> All right, let's go. So this is another derby. Ah, uh, Tonberry Derby. <laughs> So basically, the trick is, guys, if you're not very good at racing the birds, your goal is actually to um, find the shortcuts. Either speed up your chocobo a lot, or find the shortcuts. And then it doesn't matter if you can't, uh, you know, uh, do the drift or whatever. You don't need to worry about that. All you have to worry about is finding the shortcuts. It's that simple. Dun, 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 dun. Shortcuts are the key. <laughs> now people know why I called them a cult. That group, because they are a cult. Oh, Linky, what are you doing, you sick? Okay, that's... Where's me and my camera? That's adorable. What are you doing? You turning your, like, little cat climber into a jungle gym? He's like, yes. Yes to all those things. I like making them work. So how big do you think Link is now? Like, how... Like, he's like twice the size of Zelda. He's like a small dog. A big boy. I mean, I'm already winning, but... Whoa! Linky, be nice to Zelda. Uh-oh. Ouch! That was painful. That took away all my speed, too. Oh, wait, no, it didn't. How fast can you make your chocobo go? How fast? That is really disturbing. It makes so much sense, though. Okay. Just like last time, they're adding people in the chat right now.
considering that's an old phrase. Shoot. Uh oh. I mean, I was so far ahead of people, I might actually still win, right? Oh yeah, I got this locked up. In the bag. In the choker bag. Look at that. Look at that. You think Link is 45 pounds, Jackson? Really? Amber, do you remember how big Zelda is or no? Um, I think Link is like... <clears throat> I think Link is like, uh... I think he's like... I think Zelda is like 15 pounds, so I think Link... Oh my gosh. I think Link is like... I think he's like 17 pounds or something, I don't know. I think he's a little bit bigger than I think Zelda. he's 20 something. Whoa, 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 whoa! Where's my squirt bottle? Linky, stop! Leave Zelda alone, she doesn't want to play. Oh, thank you for the super chat, Alex. Appreciate that. Thank you so much, Alex. As as I cannot wait to see these sick people run in jail for DDoSing and hurting kids. Mm hmm. And they're the kind of freaks I fight hard, so hard against. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, thank you, Alex. C -H My Coral Championship. <clears throat> there we go. I wonder how long a championship race is. Thank you, PJ. We appreciate that. Mm, thank you, PJ. Really appreciate that. Chocobo mm. race. So I fully appreciate. Uh, I su I support you guys giving an opinion on how you guys feel. Thank you, PJ. It's very kind of you. Three, two, one, go. Bird time. All right, everybody, keep an eye out for a shortcut or ways to make our bird faster. One or the other. My bird's so fast, I don't even need to worry about drifting very much. No! Oh, now what is this? Now it's um, Among Us. Or not Among Us. What's the name of that game again? It's not Among Us. Uh, give me a sec. Give me a sec. So if you hit the wall, you're toast. Bird away! I don't know if I'm going to be able to catch these guys. I'm going to try. Gotta keep an eye out where those things are spinning. Fall guys! That's what it is. It's fall guys. That's what it is. Spinning obstacles, things like that. That's totes fall guys. That's what that is. Bird's getting a little faster. Not a lot faster, but a little. Oh my gosh, what just happened? I might have to do this race again. Ouch. And that's why you drift. So it's literally a brand new account.
So if they bump into me, I lose my speed. But if they don't bump into me... Ouch. Oh, no. No! I lost. I don't know what Choco GP is. Choco GP is a racing game. I... You guys getting it? I don't know... I don't know... I thought Choco GP was a racing game that came out years ago. Can you Google know. it? Okay. Go! <laughs> go, Bluebird, go, Bluebird, go, 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 go. Ow. I know, right, Link? That was rude, wasn't it? The dude came out of nowhere. Don't get it, don't get it, don't get it. Oh, it's on a Nintendo console, or...? No! Oh, it's a race- oh, it's a Chocobo racing game. Yeah, it's a Chocobo racing game. No. I thought it happened quite a while ago. What year did it release? Or well, it hasn't released yet. Well, I'm trying to figure it out. Oops, I hit the wrong button. Crap. <gasps> ah! Fantasy Racer Chocobo GP quietly relaunches as a complete title. Quietly re releases. When? May 31st, 2023, in the UK oh, eShop and also in the PlayStation Shop. So it already came out. It came out in May. This last last May. But I think it I think they randomly did an update. It says update 2023. Eight months ago it says it got fixed or whatever. Like there was, What does that mean by fixed? I guess there was some problems or Ah. It was a patch. Mm, I don't really understand if they're doing another one or... Oh! Chocobo... GP. Mm. I connect with this fool. No, no, no! No, no, no! I was winning! Crud! Choco fly! Oh wow, Luke. Mm. What? Yeah, just... I don't want to do it for some bullshit and weird. They probably just changed their channel. Mm. Was it created August of last year? Oh, you made it. Just made it! <clears throat> Thank you so much, Travis. Mm -hmm. Really appreciate the uh, super chat. Thank you so much for your kindness. Uh, Game of Travis says, I love you both so much. Thank you for the joy you both bring to your fans and YouTube alike. We need more people like you in the world. Thank you very much. Travis. All right, should we keep going? Should we try? The uh, behemoth, or <laughs> that's not behemoth. What is that called? Uh, Bayo. Bay. Uh. Oh, behemoth. Yeah, it is. It's not supposed to be a. Bah oh, it's not Bahamut. So it is it's the not behemoth. Bahamut, it's okay. Behemoth. Thank you, Travis. Thank you, Travis, for the kind words. Hope you're having a great night. Thank you so much for the encouragement, and for the super chat, Travis. Thank you so much. Oh, 
right, thank you so much for the highlighted message, Ruby. How do you beat the boss in the ghostly castle? So it's playing Princess Peach Showtime today. How do I beat the boss in the ghostly castle? What is a ghostly the boss? Um, if you could tell me what the boss is. What kind of boss is it? Is it a snake or is it the? Are you talking about the first? Ghostly castle. Sorry. Thank you, Ruby. Let me look this up. Go boss in the ghostly castle. Thank you, Travis. All right, here we go. Bohemoth Grand Prix. Time. Thank you for your encouragement, Travis. I appreciate that so much. I'm racing so badly and yet still winning. I love the different variations of the chocobo theme, it's kind of fun. If you hit the wall, they take away your speed, though. So you don't want to hit the wall very much. Ow. What is it, Linky? Oh, the boss in the ghostly castle is the is the um how to unlock the uh, the first um little fighter guy in the basement. You have to fight that um sword boss. Oh. To, to unlock the sword guy. Oh. The you, little sword person. You have to um you have to jump over him. So you have to time your jump. You have to wait and they till they attack you and hit the whatever your dodge button is. You're supposed to hit that. So that that's the swashbuckler thing. Yeah, the swashbuckler okay. um, boss. Yeah. Yep, exactly. No, I failed. Mmm. That was bad. That was bad. That was bad. That was super, super, super bad. Second sword fire stage, the soul flare. Yeah. Yeah, you have to learn how to uh, dodge with your sword fighter and you'll be fine. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Game of Travis. You're very kind. We're just uh, normal people and the world is just getting crazy around us. To be yeah, pretty much. It's just like... Our thinking hasn't changed in 20 years. We're, like, we're the same as we've always been. I don't... Yeah. Oh, I missed a shortcut. The shortcut's over there. No. Mm. Uh, I mean, I should probably redo this race. Yep, I lost. Yep. Sadness. Thank you, thank you Travis, for the encouragement, and thank you for the kind words. Thank you so much. One sec. All right, here we go. Mm. Two, one, race! Go, be go, birdie, go, birdie, go, go, go. Oops. I didn't see, did we already hit our light goal? Yeah, we did, okay. Uh, next light goal is 140, guys and gals. I need to find the shortcut or I'm gonna lose. Shortcut is the key. Nice jump, Linky. You know that's Zelda's perch, though. She doesn't like it when people take her perch. You're just asking for a territorial fight. Like West Side Story, but with cats. Chocobos are cute. Definitely PJ. Ah, I missed it again. That's the checkpoint. Yeah, so the Chocobos is just the... Like, it's just the... Like, basically, think of Final Fantasy... It, you guys aren't used to a lot of things in Final Fantasy. You just think of like everything in Final Fantasy has their own name. So like basically the little bears in Final Fantasy aren't called bears, they're called uh moogles. And the birds Wait, did you, you called the people with little wings bears? Uh that's what you interpret them as? Yeah. Okay. And then the birds in Final Fantasy aren't called birds, they're called chocobos. Everything in Final Fantasy has a different name than in real life. Uh, that's how I see it. I guess you're my version wrong. of reality is a little different. I don't think you're wrong. 
It's a unique way of explaining it, but I don't think it's wrong. Well, I had a unique way of explaining what Freedom Fighter was, and that was incorrect. Yeah, that was weird. <laughs> In my mind. In my mind, that was what the game was, but that wasn't actually what the game was. Okay. That's the, that's the shortcut right there. That's it. Okay, thank you. Hi, Trayvon. Ah! Hi, Game Wing. Hi, um, Game of Travis. Hi, everyone. Hi, Jeffrey. Hope you guys are all having a great day. Great to oh, see everyone. Oh, no. I was winning and I lost. It's over. Oh, no. This yep. does remind me of Mario Kart. Well, you make one mistake, it's over. Like, I'll never catch these guys again because, uh, it took all my. It took my. It took me two laps to, to reach first place. I wish I could say I was good at Mario Kart and could help, but I'm not good at Mario Kart. This isn't, this isn't like Mario Kart. I can imagine these birds. Oh, they could. I imagine them traveling on Rainbow Road. Mm hmm. so close. So if I hadn't made that one mistake before, I would have won. I made that one one error. That cost me the race. Hello, Game Wing 1. Hi, Trayvon. Hi, Jackson. Hi, everyone. Uh, the light goal is one, either 140 or 160. One of those. I guess we're 140 until we get eight more likes. Link, you coming over here, or are you going to destroy my couch? Okay, you're going to your tower? Alright, you go to your tower, buddy. Why didn't you go to your very top of your tower? You don't usually hang out on the second tier of it. How are we tonight? Hey, pretty, Trayvon. Pretty good. Hi, Trayvon. Good to see you. How are we tonight, Alex? Pretty good. I hope you're doing good too today, Alex. Hope everyone in the chat is having a good night. I'm having a pretty good night. <laughs> I don't want to sing, but... I'm mean, yeah. <laughs> Never mind. The full moon is out and I'm relatively calm, so that's a good thing. <laughs> <laughs> sometimes the... Sometimes I get, like, emotional when there's, like, a full moon out, but I'm completely fine today for some reason. Yeah, I'm here for moral. So I'm here for moral support in case Luke is crying because we end up not getting Tifa. Tifa. <sighs> I have to finish all these bird races. I mean, I don't have to finish these bird races. I'm Oh no, I fell! Mm. Falling is a big problem. I just play all my speed. And I need and I need is for ow, birds. Stop it! Oh. Yeah, I am looking forward to your stream tonight, Alex. Yep. In fact, I thought about uh, taking a small nap so I could be up for your stream, but. Maybe I'll just see if I can make it all the way through. <clears throat> We're gonna try it. Mean. See what happens. Yeah, guys, don't forget, there's a stream tonight. It's gonna be really awesome. It's Lun Lunar! <laughs> Lunar, yeah. Lunar Which is stars, really so. interesting. It's fitting because there's a full moon today, apparently. Yeah! And Lunar, I'm assuming... Has something to do with the moon? Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. 
Moon plays a part. Alright, as long as we don't fall, we can win. If we fall, we can't win. I've been having a good day because we finished Princess Peach, and that was a very cute finale. Mm. And I had fun doing that. Everyone was in a great mood for the finale. I also got... I got Rapunzel today in the... In the Dr Dreamlight Valley game. I earned about 4,000 Dreamlight points in that game. Oh, wow. Yeah, and I wasn't in a good mood when I was doing that. Well, I was listening to books on tape, so I was in a happy mood. I've, I've almost finished... Uh, Miss... Uh, I've almost finished... Uh, Murder on the Orient Express by Agatha Christie. I'm very close to the end on that. The book. The book. Yeah. I, I'm not going to spoil the ending for anyone who wants to read it, so I won't spoil it. It's a good story, but I still don't know who done it, and I'm not even anywhere... I'm I'm about 30 minutes from the end of the book, which is about... I'm listening to the book, it's about like six and a half hours long. I'm 30 minutes from the end. It's very interesting. Um, I did not meet the love of my life until I was in my 20s. Uh, I had been dumped by girls, and I had girls who even didn't think I was straight. So, like, I had, from, like, the time that everybody else was dating and had a girlfriend, I was miserable because, like, I couldn't get one. Uh, I never made it past a second date with girls. I got lucky once with, I think, I almost got a second date, and then the girl decided, no, I'm gonna show up with your friend and go to prom instead. So, almost, almost, because I, I took her to, um, I, we had, like, this weird, like, milkshake place, and it went well, and then she agreed to be my date to prom, because it was gonna be my last year at that high school. And then she was like, no, nah, I actually, you know what, I'm gonna go with your friend from junior high instead. And it's like, well, I'm done with this chick. So, yep. It wasn't until college that I met Amber. So. And we, we've been married now almost, uh... We've known each other for 20 years. We've been married for 18. I think. Uh, 2003. I met you in 2003. Leroy said that happened to me too, Luke. Yeah. I'm sorry that happened, Leroy. Yep. Ultimate mistakes. Ultimate mistakes. Oh, wow. Chad said girls approached me in high school, but I was too oblivious to notice. <laughs> oh, wow, Chad. So you were like an anime protagonist. Interesting. Basically, what I can tell you is I searched um, a long time for my dream girl, and when I stopped to look, then she appeared. When I tried really, really hard to find her, I didn't find her. And then when I just stopped and I was like, you know what, I'm just going to focus on my life. I'm going to, you know, go to school, do whatever. I happened to run into Amber, like, at work. I was doing an odd job, and, you know... Uh, I met Amber in the least likely place than I ever would have met somebody. And I wasn't looking for her. I gave up looking. And then I found her. Sometimes when you stop looking for something, you end up finding something better. That's... I mean, it's kind of cheesy, but... Yeah, j Dog says, I didn't meet the love of my life till I was 20... 29 when j Dog met his wife. Mm-hmm. Very cool, J Dog. I don't think I can cheese it the way I have been. Whoa! Whoa! Oh god. Maybe I can. Maybe I can. So this is the Ultima race, so they're gonna throw everything at you. Luke is speaking facts this cool breeze. I don't know about that. I mean I, no. I stopped I stopped looking and the more you look for something, the harder it is to find. I actually was going to take a job in Florida to be a carpenter so I could make money so I could buy video games. Ray John, <laughs> Ray John said people didn't want to talk to me, high school or girls. That's okay, Ray John. Just know, like, every time, no. every time it doesn't work out with, like, 
certain girls just know that, you know, that's because you're meant to be with somebody else. You're, you're being prevented from being with the wrong girl. That's why that's happening. Because you're not supposed to be with any of them. You're gonna meet her, like, another time. That's what I believe. Everything is for a reason, so... You know, if nobody is talking to you in a certain time of your life, that's because you're not supposed to meet um, the love of your life yet. Mm. She's not there. So don't, don't worry about it. It will happen when it's supposed to. Wait, this is supposed to be the ultimate race? I'm doing really well, considering. Those look like little carrots. Um, I don't know if they're carrots. They're something. I don't know if carrots would be the right word for it, but... I mean, birds do like certain things. Oh no! I can't tell if this was a shortcut or if this was a horrible thing to just do now. So I'm gonna speed up. Oh no, I went the right way. Never mind. All right, final lap. Let's see if we can pull this off. Yeah, you're gonna be over in the talking to people. That's fine when they're circle. I'm just saying, like, you know, like, if it's not working out, it doesn't mean it's never gonna happen. That might not be the right time. Mm -hmm. But I mean, 23 is, is too soon to give up. Like, I mean, I, I gave up at 20. <laughs> I was done. Um, uh, yeah, we did the... Luke and I... We did the most important thing first. Which is... Um, find the person we were going to spend the rest of our life with. And then... We have a lot of other things that we still want to work on. Both of us want to... Um, work on music and... Different things like that. Voice acting and stuff. So it depends on... You know, the one thing I won the Ultima race! Am I done? Is it over? It says I won every Chocobo race, so what does that mean? Did I did I complete it? Did I do good? Um I I don't see the gold race anywhere. I did I did nine races, so what happens? Oh, cool! Isaiah Please says remember I'm in the that you are always welcome here, sir. Son of a bitch. So, did I do it? Ready to ruffle some feathers in the gold cup? Uh, how, how do I do the gold cup? I did all the races. Which of these races will you be competing in? Wait, do you have to do all of them with the different grades? Ugh. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing all the cups again. Oh, we're not done yet. Oh my gosh, that's a lot of races. Yee. One more, says Leroy. Uh, okay. I'll do one more race. All we've been doing is racing. Yeah, definitely winner's circle. I under I can hear I understand what you're saying. Yep. Yeah, and I like yep. Yeah, and definitely, um Um definitely I you know, I agree Alpha and J Dog what you guys were saying too, definitely. I actually remembered um, something. It, it wasn't it wasn't that girl from Illinois, there was one more. That that's when I swore off. It was the uh, college incident. I am in the background supporting, not talking much, because I'm watching the Back to the Future trilogy right now. It says Isaiah. Nice. Awesome, Isaiah. So Isaiah got really psyched for uh, mm. the Back to the Future thing, and then he wanted to watch the movies. It felt like we were watching a movie last night. It was so well done. Oh. Yeah, definitely. Oh wow. Well, I mean, that's great that you're still friends with the with the girl that you dated um, for over a year, Jackson. That's nice. Mm -hmm. uh, I am 29 and single, trying not to give all, up altogether, says Merciful. Mm -hmm. Some days are harder than others. God's will is better than mine. He is enough. That's all I need to remind myself. There you go. Yeah, definitely. I mean, that's what... I mean, a lot of people ask us, like, about why things work out, and Luke and I, and neither of us is perfect, but 
with nope. all with all of our dates. When we first started dating, we would like pray every uh, date that we went on that uh, you know, Christ would be the center of our relationship, and that's what the reason why it's worked out really. Mm -hmm. That's we only are both religious. So. That's the only reason it's really worked out. Yep, definitely merciful warrior. Hmm. And I'm getting so used to doing uh, these chocobo voices. Oh, never mind, it failed. Ah! Yeah, I mean, yeah, exactly. Like a lot of people in the chat are saying, like, folk, uh, you know, they spend time focusing on themselves or focusing on their relationship with God. Yeah, definitely. I mean, that's really a huge thing. Yep, definitely, um, Alpha and J Dog, and, um, yep, definitely. I agree. Yep. And God, God could definitely lead you to the right person, definitely. Wait, was this, uh. Wait, I'm in fourth? College incident sounds ominous to Cyril. It, no. We don't want to talk about it. College over. incident wasn't that bad. It's just, it had to do with, um. Uh, you don't you don't remember that story? I remember lots of stories you told me. I don't wanna think about it again. I'm I don't know. It was the one with the girl. I'm, I'm having post traumatic stress thinking about it again. No. It's the snowstorm story. I don't know what snowstorm story. I was okay, I was working at the uh, dish place. I was interested in this girl who was from Jersey. I don't I don't want I don't know if I wanna hear this because I know there was a bad thing that happened. No, it has nothing to do with that. It uh has to do with, like, I thought this girl was giving off all the signals, and I thought that she was interested in me. Turns out she was interested in my roommate, so all the work that I did was actually kind of like how in that anime, anime where sometimes you're, you know, hanging out with this girl and you think she really likes you, but she's hanging out with you to get to your friend. So. That's pretty messed up, Luke. Yeah, and um, she was sick from school once, and I was getting back because I worked in the kitchen, so I had soup and a thermos, and I braved the snow which it snowed a lot at that school, so the snow was up to my kneecaps. I was wading through the snow with my tiny thermos of soup because I heard she was sick, and I was like, you know what, if I show up and I make her feel better, maybe she'll actually go out with me. <laughs> so I went there, and she was like, that was really sweet. And I was like, well, yeah. And she says, I'm so sorry, but I actually like your friend. And I was just like, uh. <laughs> so, because I literally, I had to walk in that snow and the dorms were separated, the girl and guy dorms were separated from in some distance, and it was like a really, it was a big snowstorm of 2001. Ah, uh, it was right when uh, New York and Canada got hammered pretty hard, so we got a lot of snow. And I thought, you know, this, this girl, you know, she seems sweet and nice, you know, really nice church girl or whatever, but she was totally interested in my friend. And then they dated for like a whole, like, four weeks, but because like, I was his best friend. It wasn't gonna work out between us because it was weird. It was just like college sucks. <laughs> yeah. Uh. yeah, our I mean yeah, people were asking us about when mm -hmm. we actually prayed on our dates. Yeah, Before we drove. It, it is true. We would we would we prayed probably on all of our dates um, that Christ would be the center of our relationship. We did that for like a whole year, if not more. Um, actually, Luke asked me a lot of poignant questions on our first date about my just, you know, just what... Um, well, in my defense, I was coming back from Bible college, like so what I was... The, like, I had a lot of interesting questions from Luke about, you know, what I... I don't know, I guess the... Um, <gasps> what I felt about... No! Life and stuff like that. No, 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 no! I just, um... It was actually a little bit terrifying. And I was a little bit freaked out because, like... Uh... I don't know. But, I mean, it's probably good that he did, because actually it's probably good that people have the same outlook on life, you know, like that. No! But even if Luke didn't, um, like, agree with me on it, oh, are you okay? I failed! Even though Luke probably, Luke and I disagree on some things, but at least we could actually talk about it and, you know, like, it's still good to talk about it, even if you disagree. Um... <sighs> 
Uh, yeah, so Merciful Warrior was, or I'm sorry, um, Winter Circle was saying, um, what, uh, Whoops, we forgot to promote. Um, hang Aww. on, guys. Uh, if you guys could watch the short real quick, there's a hundred of you guys. I just, uh, yeah. I need first place. I know. I failed. I messed up, okay? I'm sorry. I, I messed up. If you guys could watch the short real quick. Oh, I'm sorry. Tim Muller said he did a super chat last night and we missed it. So he's wrote it again so we could see it. Okay. Tim Muller says, last time I did a five dollar super chat, and this is what I said. Here's something for you to help Luke and Amber. I've been praying for you guys every night. If you missed it this morning, I said it earlier. Thank you, Tim. Appreciate the super chat so much. I'll do this super. Thank you for the prayers, Tim. Appreciate that so much. Sorry, I missed it. Thank you so much, Tim. You're breathtaking. Thank you so much for the prayers. Are your eyes watering? Um, a little bit. That's not good. My eyes are watering too. Hi, so. Darren. Yep, we definitely did miss you. Definitely. I'm sorry that you have to go to therapy for that, Alex. I'll definitely keep you in my thoughts and prayers. Definitely. I understand it. I'm sure it's very difficult, Alex. Yep, definitely, Jason. God is on your side and can lead you who to look for. Definitely, Jason. Yep. Uh... Wait, you learned some lessons from Cyberpunk, Winter Circle? Hmm. Cyberpunk taught me some life lessons about coping and living by your own decision and choosing what you want to be. Interesting, Winter Circle. Well, that's kind of cool. I'm glad that something positive came out of that game with all the... Glitches it originally. No, I'm just kidding. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's interesting. Uh, remember when I told you guys I was autistic? I spent several years. I was trying to find out about self love because there was all this hate and it ate away at me because life was difficult. I'm so sorry, Winter Circle. Yeah, and then I realized that everybody has um has to, um, I realized that life, what was that? Oh my gosh. Hang on, honey. we really gotta push this short. Okay, sorry. Um, guys and gals, we really gotta push this short. Um, so, if you could just take a, mm. a minute to, uh, watch that short, we'll be right back. Okay. Um, leave a comment, tell us what you think about it. You got a hundred people here, so be right back.
All right, guys and gals, we're close to 100 views on the YouTube short. Thank you very much. Uh, mods will be pushing the YouTube short every, oh, 15 minutes or so. And uh, we're going to try this race again. So according to Leroy, um, we need to get gold medal or, you know, need to get first place in order for this whole Chocobo race thing to end. And apparently there's even more Chocobo races, but we're only mm, doing one more. Because uh, this entire stream has been Chocobo Races. In fact, we might even rename the stream Chocobo Races because that's all that's been done. <laughs> I planned on racing for an hour. It became an hour and 30 minutes. It's fun, though. It is fun. What a Jackson? What can't you see, Jackson? Two, one, go! This is the Efrit course. This is supposed to be the Efrit course. Wouldn't there be like fire and brimstone? You know, he's a fire summon. You know, there's like really no fire. I'm just saying. Like, yeah. I, I would expect like molten lava, like uh, Bowser's course or something like that. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Oh well. Yeah, in Efrit's course. Yeah, it should have lava. It should have lava. It has... You can fly in it. Oops. Well, who wants to fly? Bird. Oof. All right, so fifth place on the first lap. Not bad. We're in good positioning. So far, so good. Now they made it all wintry. See, this this is not Efrit. Efrit is not winter. He's not a winter wonderland. It's quite the opposite of that. He's fire and brimstone. Weird. Yeah. It is. It is. Third place, first lap. So basically what happened is I choked at the end. Like, I was doing great. Sorry. Wow. Yeah. I was doing great, and then, um... It's okay. I was doing great, and then the last... I think it was like the last leg of the la uh, the race, I just kind of I veered off. Everything got messed up. You don't have to be awake if you don't want to be. You're pushing yourself really hard. I know you. I know you. Mm -mm. Say it again. I'm sorry for being huh? You can't help getting tired. Oops. Well, you said you were doing great. And, and I choked. You choked on the very end of it. Choked yeah. on the very end, yeah. Uh, second place on the second lap. That's pretty good. Now things get dicey. Now things get a little dicey. Oof. Hold it, hold together. Don't you botch this. Okay, we're going this way. Mm. Mm. Okay. Yeah, I heard what you said, Winter Circle. Um. Uh, I'm glad that you learned some life lessons from that. That's really good. Oh, no! Shoot, shoot, shoot! This is a problem. This is a big problem. This is, this is all it takes is one mistake. One mistake, one mistake, one mistake. One mistake. No, 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 no. Oof. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. 
Yeah, it it is. Um. It's very nice of you to to, to encourage other people when you're circled. Definitely. It. No, 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 no. Yeah, I think those are really, um, really good life lessons you learn when you're circled. I agree. Almost there, almost there, almost there. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going, this is home stretch. This is where things get really nasty. Oof. Ah! Don't you die on me, bird. Don't you die on me! Thank you for subscribing, Winter Circle. Appreciate that so much. Don't bottle it, sister. I'm trying! Means botched. Oh. It's a new way of saying botched. We got it! We did it! Woo! You can increase things to your chocobo to drift and other boosts, says Vanguard. Yeah, I'm okay. Um, hi, Tiger39. I don't really understand about the. Kotaku thing, but I didn't even know Kotaku did guides to... Yeah, okay. Hey, Leroy, what's going on now? Do I have to race anymore? We're all looking forward to your next They're still race. making me race more! Your bird will be in peak condition. Trust me. I thought that was the last race, or that's just the last race I need to be gold. I don't want to do races anymore. Awesome. That's great. The following races are scheduled for today. Contact her again, says Leo. I'm from New York, says Winter Circle. I'm 23. I'm majoring in journalism and minoring in music. Awesome, Winter Circle. Very cool. Luke's from New York as well. Yeah, I'm not doing the Gold Cup today. We'll maybe do that tomorrow. We I eagerly you. await your return. Short, says Anthony. That's a lot of, uh... It's a lot of racing. Alright. We actually have, uh... There are a lot of people, um... Hold on here, we'll do more races tomorrow. Uh, for new subscribers that you were saying, you were mentioning that We've arrived at your destination. Yeah, for yeah, for you were mentioning um, you know, you had autism. I was just saying there we have a lot of viewers with autism that watch actually. Um, we have a lot of um, a lot of people that um, that share the same struggles and stuff. That's yeah. A lot of very creative and kind and hardworking people that, that happen to have autism that watch our channel. Oh, here's the moment of truth, I guess. Um, that one's on level 36, level 25, level 23, level 23. Level 21, save that one. Okay. Alright. This is for all. The entry deadline for our Thou Art Rosa contest has passed. And we are no longer accepting submissions. Gouts of blood, screams of pain. All that gore and more awaits you in tomorrow's gruesome match at Battle Square's Musclehead Coliseum. Aren't you? I hear you'll be taking part in the main event at the Coliseum tomorrow. Uh, one of your comrades is hoping to spend a moment alone with Cloud. Cloud's relationship with his ally will determine how this portion of the story will unlock. If you wish to improve a bond with the teammate, complete any remaining odd jobs which feature them before you proceed. 
You'd better rest up before your big day. Where... Where is... Where is Tifa located now? Gouts of blood. Screams of pain. All that gore and more awaits you in tomorrow's gruesome match at Battle Square's Musclehead Coliseum. <laughs> Tifa's back at the chocobo place? The entry deadline for our Thou Art Rosa contest is... I'll go see. Where would you like to go, Koopo? Go, Koopo. Hold on to your hat, Koopo! And here we are! Here you go. You can beat this to one of the chocobos. No. Congratulations on your victory. What are your thoughts on the victory? You like it's fine about a crop of chocobos than what we got. Let's take some chocobo race fans. In the mood for more like yeah, I don't see Tifa at the Chocobo Square unless she's outside of it. We look forward to serving you again soon, Koopo. Like I don't see this thing. Just enter the race. You can see her. I don't think so. I mean, I don't. I think Leroy just wants me to race more of the Chocobo stuff. I'm not seeing Tifa anywhere. Like she's not here. You can beat this to one of the Chocobos. Now hold your hand out near their beats. Remember. Like I literally did an hour and forty minutes of races. Yurion's gonna take it again. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, you're right. Oh, yeah. Okay. Here you go. You can beat this to one of the chocobos. Now hold your hand out near their beak. Remember. Vanguard, where is the dust bowl? They'll be afraid of us. Your trusty guy, Moo, is at your service. Attention, chocobo race fans. In the mood for more competitive thrills? Swing by the policy. We look forward to serving you again soon, Koopo. The stakes have never been higher, folks. This is a must-see match. Just name the square, and I'll get you there. And away we go. And here we are. Alright guys, I'm just gonna progress the thing. If it doesn't work, then I have um, a save file to come back here. Screams of pain. <laughs> Looking to rest in peace. Best of luck to you tomorrow. I trust you. Knock him dead. <laughs> No idea you were into songwriting. <laughs> oh, I'm not. But I wanted to give it a shot. I see. Well, good for you. Never know till you try. Hmm. Oh. <gasps> ah. <laughs> they say curiosity <laughs> killed the cat. It looks like uh, 
Aerith was getting ready to destroy the cat. He saw himself through the other cloud's eyes. What? We have to play as Zack? Where's the date? Uh, I don't think the date's happening till tomorrow. Darn! Here. Are you freaking kidding me? Yeah, you may as well go to sleep. I'm sorry. Cloud's all yours. I'll take care of Aerith after. Yes, ma'am. Yep, I'll be changing the thumbnail. Great job ruining it, Zack. I did now's not a good time for Zack. Now's not a good time, Zachary. Uh, unless this is a short. Cloud, it's sponge bath time! Aerith sure does sleep a lot, huh? It's better this way. What? Why? Because of Cloud. He's still sick. I'll say. Please. You gotta make Cloud get better. You gotta. I mean, I'd love to, but... You, uh... You said it's better for Aerith to stay asleep because Cloud's sick. Why is that? Because... She'll die if she wakes up. Oh. You think? What makes you say that? Uh Promise not to tell? <sighs> when she wakes up... A scary man is going to kill her. Huh? Cloud tries to save her, but he doesn't make it in time. He almost does, but he doesn't. She likes Cloud, so she's happy he came. Really, really happy. But... But she dies. That's why you have to make Cloud better. If he's sick, he can't save Aerith. <sighs> Marlene, are you sure you didn't just have a bad dream? No. I saw it. Oh, okay. I did! <laughs> Don't worry, I believe you. With everything that's going on, how could I not? Okay. Just one question, if it's all right. Can you tell me what the scary man looked like? Please? His hair was long. And gray. Of all the people. Zach, did you see? They're blooming. Would you look at that? These were always Aerith's favorites. Do you think this means she's going to wake up? <sighs> Maybe. Can always hope. <sighs> hey, Elmira. I've got to go away for a bit. I need to talk to someone about Cloud. And who is this someone? A doctor? Well, 
Jeez, uh... Close enough, I suppose. Well, hurry on back, okay? It's hard enough looking after these two with your help, but without it... Without you, I'd be a wreck. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm going by bike. Shouldn't take long. Just keep an eye on them while I'm gone, okay? Oh, and if Aerith does wake up, please don't let her leave. <laughs> no promises. That girl snuck out more times than I can count. <laughs> don't let her. Please. I won't. Wait. He thinks that Sephiroth is going to kill Aerith. Well... We know that no. this isn't happening tonight. I'm even more shocked that Eris' mom likes Zack. I thought she hated Cloud. Yeah, she didn't like Cloud. He proved himself to her mom. She's actually being nice. Make sure to that you're back by dinner. Mm, all right. So then tomorrow. That's what I'm really be... shocked about is the mom was so mean to Cloud, and she's super nice to Zack. Mm-hmm. Like, what a difference. A big difference. Also, I noticed something about the mom, but I'm not allowed to say it because, like, people are going to cancel me so much. What? Just, like, if you actually look at her face and you look at, like, older celebrities that have gotten plastic surgery, mm. that's what she looks like. She Make looks sure like that she you're back by dinner. Oh, no. All right, Zach, let's go. So the little girl, Marlene, has visions, just like Aerith does. Why is that? You know what? I'm sick of things in Final Fantasy, me being like, huh, what? But Cloud wasn't there, I wonder why? Everyone always doing this. Why do they have to write everything so mysteriously in these games? Why, Square Enix, why? Oh, Winner's Circle was saying, I wonder why we don't know a lot about the creators. Um, yeah. Interesting. I thought about what you said. Couldn't stop thinking about it, actually. About how it's, it's up to each, each of us to find, find our own purpose in life. Because in Avalanche, I think I've found mine. We don't have a whole lot of time. So tonight's got to be the night. Do yourself a favor and steer clear of Reactor 6. Take care, Biggs. No, I didn't... That's not what I meant! Gotta find Elmira. Oh. Two hours later. Maybe it is still happening. Please don't be red. Don't be red. Don't be red. Don't be red. Oh, thank God. Doze off? No. Those pillow marks say different. Yeah, yeah. You got me. <laughs> anyway, wanna broaden your artistic horizons? Loveless is playing here. And I got us tickets. Sure. After that, we could ride the Skywheel. Right. We missed out on that before. Yeah, but not this time. Let's go. It's not the dog! Ha ha ha! Oh my gosh. The only problem is the Loveless play is really long, so we'll have to do that tomorrow. But at least we know 
that Tifa is best girl. Check since it's darn. I will not be able to read Luke's tweets at 3 in the morning. Yatas is soul flare. Yeah, I, I tend to I, I tend to rage tweet. So we're going to the Battle Coliseum. Yeah, I mean, the, the date we've all been waiting for, says Rajon. Yep. Their date is tomorrow. Loveless is tomorrow. Uh, I mean, so, yeah, to answer your question, Winter Circles, some game creators are more, like, open about letting people know more about them, and some creators, you know, you don't know too much about them. It all depends on the game creator. His name is Square, and I'll get you there. Also, the pe person that wrote the story to Final Fantasy VII uh, probably was... Hold on here, I don't know who they were. They must have been somebody that worked at Square Enix a long time ago, or Square. And here we are! Sometimes the people that make a really great story, they're just like a small person in a company. You don't really hear about them. So sometimes that's why you don't always know what to do. Are you interested in joining the fray? Yeah, I am. Alright, let's do this. Okay. <clears throat> so we're going to do some Battle Coliseum. And then uh, tomorrow is going to be their date. So while Tifa and Cloud are together, they're not. The, the big date is tomorrow. So I am going to be changing the thumbnail again because. But my gosh, that moment, <laughs> that moment scared me. <laughs> uh, yeah. Um, so there's a play called Loveless Amber. The Loveless play is about thirty or forty minutes long, and then their date on the Sky Wheel is about ten minutes. Aww. So. The entire stream tomorrow is dedicated to Loveless, and yeah. But man, I feel like a huge burden has been lifted off my shoulders. You have no idea. I think no, no. Namura begged Nojima to make it like Kingdom Hearts. Interesting winner circle. Yeah, I. It sounds like you know a lot more about it than me. Um, we saw the there at and they were just doing the story. Um we now since we were three we we got to see the creators on the stage, like they were like literally looking from us and they were playing their game. Um, so that was pretty cool. And they also talked about the new direction they were going after the game. That was cool to get some insights into the ideas. What was just the planning stage for them then? Like, yeah. Get back me yeah. Ready. I owe you. The thought process of what they can do. I mean, it, it, it will be tomorrow if this gets a thousand views. Like, we're... It's gonna be close. I'm so happy you have no idea. Oh. I worked so hard for these two. Ah! Tsuya Nomura was creative director and Nojima was writer, yet Nomura's obsession with Kingdom Hearts was led into reverse for sure, you feel also. Not bad, but not my best. I don't mind. Oh, interesting winner circle. Well, that's, that's really cool. Ooh. Oh yeah, I forgot to use our chakra abilities. Tony Faname Kuran says, Tifa fell in love with Cloud. It was the kind of love where she wanted to be with him. That was how she felt. Traces of the past. Page 8. Very interesting, Tony. From the story about them. Yeah, Tifa and Cloud have always been canon, though. Like, going all the way back to the 90s. Let's go. Let's go. The date will be adorable, go. says Jackson. I really wanted it to be red because it would have been a funny short moment, says Jackson. Hmm. Back me up. Copy. I don't know if it's funny. I don't know why when people think that. Come on. The date is tomorrow. Cannot, can't be late to that, says Blue's Cat. <laughs> Yep, guys, don't forget that we're gonna have a really cool stream with Alex tonight. Lunar! Well, 
Oh my gosh, what just happened to Tifa? Let's I don't think I can use items, no can I? Nice. Nope. Cloud, do you have any ability to resurrect, buddy? Nope. Any last words? Thank you. Not bad. Not bad. Tifa died. That's not good. Wait, does Tifa have? Tifa has resurrect. Two person bout. Tale of the Red Warrior. Gold saucer point. Wow, you got a lot of gold saucer points for that one. Uh, complete two person bout. Hmm. I put in the time and I got the reward. I'm very happy. Now we just need to rename this the Golden Key Chocobo Racing. No, that's tomorrow. I'm using the same thumbnail again. I don't have any tips on dating. I still don't know how I won you. Chocobo Racing, Battle Coliseum, Aerith making... Oops. Oops, I forgot the time codes. Mm -hmm. oh. Battle time, Aerith thinking... Tifa... Good girl. Okay, let's do some more Battle Coliseum. I th Wait, I can't do that? Why? What does it say? Uh, six-person bout. Oh, darn. So I can't do anymore. What's this one? Two-person bout. Defeat the classified foe in the grasslands? Aww. I guess that does it for all the fighting. Give us a holler when you want to throw down. I want to throw down, but I can't. No, no more throw down available. Kind of disappointed. Stamp plushies right here. Get them before they're gone. Buy a fat chocobo and moogle and save with our pudgy bear combo. Grab our trio. Muscle in and, and exchange your gold saucer points gold for saucer. fabulous prizes. I would prizes. like to exchange my gold saucer points. Stuffed bomb. Mithril, I don't even know what it does. Mysterious ore that has lasting value cards. <laughs> okay. There you go. Resplendent robe. Mysterious used and enhanced. I don't care. Level boost materia for... Why? Sold out. Stuffed chocobo. Loveless poster. Gilded tentacle? Ooh. Oh, I think... Aren't these things that, um... Don't these go in Johnny's collection? I think so. I think some of this random stuff goes to Johnny. I could be wrong, though. Gold saucer cards, turbo ether, 3D brawler, da 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 the cloud, uh, Tonberry secrets of the ninja, okay, creepy dude, X potion, ooh, I'm running out of stuff already, uh, save crystal. 
Fortunes Untold. I don't know who that's for. Skywheel card. There's a feather. Weird stuff, Chocobo. Chocobo jockey card. I think that's important for something. Uh, Gold Talon. Elixir. Wait, I haven't seen elixirs in this. Fully restores HP and MP. A thousand points for an elixir. Gill up materia. What about XP up? Who has the XP up materia? I haven't even seen it once in this. Not once. All right. We hope to see your sinewy self again Looking soon. All right, guys, we're going to the space place. Got muscle head cups too. Perfect for knocking. It's space time. Trusty guy, is at your service. Uh, so we're going to end up putting uh, Chocobo on the thumbnail. Um, I don't even know what we currently have our thumbnail right now because it's not. That's not the thumbnail we're going to be using. Yeah, that's uh, Yuffie's there. I want a cool Chocobo thumbnail with them racing or something. I don't know. Maybe I'll even do more races now that Tifa's here. I don't know. Um, speed square. And away we go. Welcome, cadets. To Hi, yep, thumbnail change to you, Phoebe, because the date is tomorrow. Loveless is tomorrow. The Gilgamesh army is amassing a fleet of star cruisers on the dark side of Moon 7. You and your squadron Space. will lead our assault and break through the enemy's defensive lines. From there, you will strike at the All right, let's do this. In a bid to destroy their trade flagship. Your no characters to interact with anymore because it's just Tifa and Cloud. The fate of the galaxy. Space Rangers, ho! Yeah, let's do this. I'm excited. I enjoy this minigame, actually. I'm ready. We should try. I should try expert. Yeah, let's go. Uh, space ranger, space metal, gold saucer, X potion, gold saucer point, dark. Dark what? Gold saucer point. Gold saucer point. I don't get that many gold saucer points. Let's go! Oh, I forgot how to shoot. There we go. I don't shoot misses again. Star Fox! Space Fox. Energy depleted? What? I mean energy depleted. Oh, from dodging. Oh my gosh, why? Uh oh. Now this is Star Fox. Contact the 
Trying to. Uh oh. Didn't quite shoot them all down. Thank you, Space Ranger. Great work. Keep it up, Ranger. Enemy incoming. Move to intercept. I love the space one. It's fun. Wait, that's the warship? Oh no. I'm probably gonna die. Yikes! Not good, not good. Destroy the tail! Whoa! No shield reloading. This is a problem. the robot! There he is. Well, I made it to the final stage. But I have no shield recovery. I know! I'm aware! I have no shields. Hi, Bay. Ah! I tried. <laughs> Expert's a bit too tough. Ah, uh, I got nothing for that. Uh. Personal best was 33,000. Expert, I got demolished. Yeah. Darn! Let's go do the, um, motorcycle. Sorry, T, if I tried to show off, it didn't work. Many formidable fiends stand in our way, but we mustn't wait for I tried, I tried, I tried. Welcome, cadets, to Tried and failed! Our mission today is a final one, and we will meet 
your wholehearted support to defeat the enemy. Where would you like to go, Koopa? Where would I like to go, Koopo? Uh... I don't remember where the, uh, the races are. We look forward to serving you again soon, Koopa. It's the space section. There's supposed to be a... A motorbike or something? I don't remember where the motorbike is. They're playing Tifa's theme in the background. The battle square. Where is the um? Where's the motorcycle race? Um. Do you guys know where the motorcycle is? It's, is it in speed zone? Or is it somewhere else? Steadfast block. Okay. Use Koopo for map. Oh, we don't want to go to Skywheel yet. Racing game. Nope. Not Event Square. Not Ghostly Park. There is a motorcycle. In the boxing. I don't want to do the boxing, but I will. I do want to try the motorcycle again. Is it in Battle Square? Maybe it's in the fantasy section. Man, your trusty guide Mumu is at your service. Yeah, yeah. Speed Square, Adventure World, Battle Square, Fantasy. Wandering second floor. Event Square. No, we don't want to go there. Wonder Square. Ghost Square, Sky Wheel Square, no, that's not it either. Park Central. Why wouldn't the Speed Square be Battle Square? Maybe it is a Wonderment Square? And here we are! Your trusty guide Mumu is at your service! And away we go! And here we are! Alright, thank you, Leroy. Apparently, 
That's under instruction, uh, construction, but that looks fun. Alright, car race. More queens. Queen, whatever. Queen's blood. <laughs> I don't think I'll last very long on expert, but I'm curious. Standard, I didn't get everything either. Do it. Good job on the short, guys. It's a great. I don't think I'm going to last very long. Getting awfully low. Well, I survived, but I don't know if I did very well. I did expert. Whoa!
personal best? Whoa! Wait, I won? Cool! Nice! Wait, where, where is Tifa? Tifa, did you see me get expert? I got expert! You didn't see me get expert. Alright! What art show? Huh? Oh! Stamp the dog. That was kind of cool. Oh, they have the stamp song playing in the background. That's kind of fun. to now. Okay, so Loveless is tomorrow. Really wish I could have gotten awesome on the uh, space world, but nope. Space Expert was a little bit too... too intense. Hmm. Okay. We have arrived at my destination. That's awesome. Leader is Cloud. Oh, we're level 45? Oh, that's not bad. Not bad at all. Alright guys and gals, so tomorrow is the Loveless Tifa quest thing. Uh, look forward to it. Um, that's going to be interesting. Uh, next up, your stream is... Wait, what is the next stream again? Lunar. So it's going to take me a while to set Lunar up. Probably won't be back until close to 1.30. 1 in the morning. Past 1 in the morning. Why the heck does it say 8.30 at night? That's not correct. That's weird. That's really weird. Um, one sec, one sec. Shoot for 115. Sorry about that. Um, it shouldn't have said that. But if you guys still want to hang out with me, I'll be doing another stream. I need to get something to eat because I've not eaten anything today except for a bag of chips. And that is not a smart thing to do. I had a V8, but a V8 is not enough to, you know, sustain yourself all day. So, yeah, thanks for watching, people. I'll be changing the thumbnail later to be Chocobo-related. And uh, then Tifa and Cloud will be on episode 28. Um, so, if you guys aren't showing up for the other stream, to let you know what's going on. Uh, your streams tomorrow are as follows. Um... Apollo Justice, episode 44, needs 100 more views. So you have until the morning to get 100 more views. Uh, Final Fantasy is at 860. So it needs 100 views. And what else? Princess Peach is over, so Star Wars will be tomorrow. Star Wars Battlefront, episode 9, Hoth, is locked in. Um, Ace Attorney is highly likely. But not definite. And Final Fantasy is... Plausible. But I, I streamed for almost three hours for Final Fantasy today. I did. How long of a stream for Final Fantasy? Two hours and 33 minutes, so... And that was 870 views, so... A thousand views needed for the next episode. I'm gonna grab something to eat and uh, set up the PlayStation equipment. Alright guys, God bless, happy gaming. 
Thanks so much for watching, and uh, good luck on getting the, uh, the views required for the next episode. See you on Lunar, Silver Side Story.